So our goal in our children's program is to stimulate your child's growth through positive reinforcement. This is where the idea of the transfer teaching method comes into play. Essentially, we don't teach or correct a child through, through words, but instead actions and example. Think back to when you were first teaching your son or daughter how to feed themselves. At first you would do it for them, right? Open the tunnel, here comes the train, here comes the airplane, whatever method you used, right? Then you would put the spoon in their hands, get some food on it, um, and guide the spoon into their mouth, right? And eventually, he or she would start slapping your hand away, right? And grabbing the spoon for themselves and, and doing it themselves. Um, now, in the beginning, that was messy. It was all over their face, all over the, the high chair, all over the floor. But within a few short months, they were very self-sufficient eating machines. And they probably haven't stopped. Um, so patience is the key to success in the early stages of learning. When you see your sh child doing something, let's say a, a technique or a game in class, that you, you want them to do better, don't talk to them about it in the car or try to correct them on the edge of the mat. Instead, wait until you get home and ask if they will teach you the game that they were playing on the mat. Then take the opportunity to position your child in the correct ways and make the appropriate adjustments um, without ever having to use words or, or reprimanding the child. You know, we, want, we all want our child to do better and do the right thing the first time, but, but trust me, in time, the system we're using will take its course and your child will learn jiu-jitsu the same way they learn to eat, to walk, and to talk.